We want to transition now to KCR3 weather. We continue to follow this fire that is burning in Vacaville. If you are just joining us, we have just learned there is now evacuation orders for everyone who lives on Quail Canyon Road and for everyone on Pleasance Valley Road from Quail Canyon North to Highway 128 and west to the county line. This is an evacuation order. That means if you are hearing this, you want to get out of your home immediately. We want to get an update now on the condition. So Dirk, let's go right to you. What are we looking at at this point? Yeah, Look at again winds winds right now. There's a weather site that's pretty close to where this is located, and so we got just a three mile an hour wind, so it's not very strong, gusting to six. The only thing is these fires can actually create their own winds um, and push themselves along as well. But temperature 82 degrees, humidity has actually jumped up from 19 percent to 22 percent. And what I wanted to do now is actually just kind of move in a little bit closer and show you where we have uh, the Quail Canyon Road and you have Pleasance Valley Road. So from that intersection right here. Let me go ahead and just draw a little arrow. That's the intersection right there. So we have the uh, evacuation orders from there and then moving north. And again, Quail Canyon Road here, you have Pleasance Valley Road here. This all moves, both of them run almost parallel up towards Highway 128. And so it's this area here that we have the evacuation orders. And there's a lot of little streets that come off of Quail Canyon Road and Pleasance Valley Road. I would assume that those areas also are going to be of great concern. So anyone that lives off of these roads as well as on these roads in this area here. You can see this is a section here. The fire itself though is more towards the west side of Quail Canyon Road and the fear I assume would be is that it pushes this way more to the east to where we have more houses that are in this area. So again the winds right now are fairly light. That's good news. Hopefully they're able to uh, kind of help themselves in keeping or containing this fire from spreading too much towards the homes uh, because those winds are light, but they are forecast to get a little bit stronger as we go through the next several hours. Those winds could turn more of a west wind, pushing the flames more towards the east. At least that's what the computer models are putting out right now. Back over to you. All right, Dirk, and yeah, and with those small roads that are there, we know that emergency vehicles are going in and out of these neighborhoods. So if you're someone who is in that area, again, you're being asked to evacuate. Another reason you want to evacuate is because with fire crews trying to get in and out, some of those roads are so small in those neighborhoods. Some are one ways. You, you just want to leave them as much room as possible. And again, the number one priority is, is you just getting out. So right now we're following this fire in Vacaville. Mandatory evacuations are happening right now. We will be right back with some more.